Now we're at 751, time for News Extra, brought to you today by Herring Civic Center. And here is Kevin Mooney. Thank you, Dennis. Good morning, everyone. We're going to talk about uh, my favorite sport, golf, today. All right, cool. On a Monday morning. Uh, the uh, NIFA tournament is coming up here very soon, and we have Dave Tucson here along with... Uh, Steve Tando to tell us all about it and uh, the reason why we're going to be playing golf that day on Monday, May 20th. So Dave, Steve, welcome, first of all. Well, thanks Thank for having us. You bet. All right, so uh, first of all, let's let's tell people what uh, what NIFA is. You guys are uh, part of... Uh, it's the uh, National Association of Insurance and Financial Advisors, and they are the largest and oldest professional association of our business. All right. And so, um, and you have taken uh, it upon yourself to be in charge of this. Well, it's kind of handed down to me three down years ago. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Rick McDonald actually started this uh, six years ago after Louis Zamata passed away, and he did it for three years, and then asked if our office would take over three years ago. All right, and so you guys have done that. It's, it's in its uh, sixth year now. That's right. All right, and. Uh, so uh, uh, this golf tournament raises money for some uh, very important reasons, right? Yep. Uh, our association has always given away uh, a scholarship each year for high school students. And we went ahead and endowed another one in memory of Louis Zamonic. And our goal is to continue to raise money and endow even more. So right now we're giving away two scholarships a year. Hopefully down the road we'll give away three or four. And we also support LifeLinks, which was uh, near and dear to Louis' heart. And these kids help put together the goodie bags, and they come sell the mulligans. And uh, we've been able to donate the thousand dollars a year to LifeLinks. Yep, LifeLinks is an organization that serves uh, young people, 18 to 21, disabled young people, and uh, it's, it's great that you guys give that organization a thousand dollars every year from the golf tournament. It's wonderful. Yeah, it was something really special to Louis and Phyllis Zamonic. All right. So let's talk about this year, uh, the date, and uh, how people can get involved. You're looking at a, possibly a record number of people, right? That's what we're shooting for. It's, it's Monday, May 20th at the Scotts Bluff Country Club. It's a four-man or four-woman scramble. I know we have at least one all-female team. One o'clock shotgun. Uh, the range opens up at 1130. We'll play 18 holes, and afterwards we'll have a really fine dinner at the Scotts Bluff Country Club. We've got uh, first, second, and third place prizes, which are golf certificates to the pro shop. We will have uh, three hole prizes on the front nine, three on the back, as well as uh, a lot of prizes and, that have been donated by our sponsors. All right, that's pretty good. Yep. So it sounds like a fun day, and you have a lot of teams already signed up. We've got 24 signed up, which is close to the record. We're shooting for 34 teams this year, which definitely would be a record. And the new pro, Jason Meininger, has promised that we were going to have great weather that day. So. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, he must have a must have a line up to the man upstairs, I guess, huh? All right, that's great. It would be wonderful if, uh, if the weather was very good that day. I, I've played in this tournament a couple times, and I can't think of one day where it wasn't nice weather. The last couple of years have been pretty good. We actually moved it back a week, which has kind of helped out. Yeah, yeah, it kind of helps out. Yeah. So uh, let's, let's give the mic to Steve here. Uh, um, so uh, you're going to play in the tournament, right? Oh, absolutely, yeah. 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 I wouldn't miss it. Yeah, no question about it. All right, and uh, and you work with Dave here. Kind of explain the organization you guys uh, are involved with. With the NAFA organization? Yeah. Well, NAFA, there's, like Dave said, it's the National Association of uh, Insurance and Financial Advisors, and we have have a real good local membership here, and, and the, basically... Uh, it's a group that goes to Washington and to state capitals and so forth, keeping insurance the good product that it is. And, uh, you know, they're always looking for more money to, to take away from people, and, and insurance has been one of the best things people can invest in. And so uh, it's, they're just an organization that works for us and, and virtually for everybody that owns insurance. So when you get it, you don't pay the taxes on it. That's the main thing. So. But... Uh, our local organizations, uh, very good. Got a lot of a lot of people here in the local organization. Uh, having our state uh, state uh, organization meeting in Omaha here in a few weeks, and uh, so it's, I'm just happy to be and very proud to be part of the NAFA organization. All right, 
We'll take a break, tell you how you can get into the tournament right after this. go through the gold, silver, and bronze sponsorship thing, too, maybe. You want to do that? We got, about, we got about a couple of minutes here, so. All right, we're back on News Extra. Dave Tucson, Steve Tando are here to talk about the uh, uh, 2013 NAFA Golf Tournament, which is uh, coming up Monday, May 20th. And it will benefit uh, some scholarship opportunities as well as LifeLinks, an organization that helps young people with disabilities. And uh, so, Dave, you got 2014 signed up. You'd like to have 34. How do, you, how do people get in? How do people sign up? Well, they can call our local office, which is 308-635-1094, or they can send me an email at dtuzon at gmail.com. That's T-U-Z-S-O-N, and I can email you back a registration form. All right. Can they sign up just by calling the country club, too, maybe? Uh, I'm sure they could, and Jason could relay that information to you. And Jason can relay that information to you. you and it's a great opportunity. Monday, May 20th, you can take a Monday afternoon off. And uh, look forward to a Monday for a change, rather than going, oh, i got to go back to work. Right? Yep. <laughs> and, of course, the staff at the Country Club always does a great job with the dinner afterwards. So that's yeah, always fun it is. Too. It's a wonderful dinner, and uh, it's a really good time. So uh, put it on your calendar, Monday, May 20th. It's $300 for a foursome. And you can also be a gold sponsor, a silver sponsor, or a bronze sponsorship opportunities, too. Dave can uh, fill you in on that. Uh, when you when you give them a call or or email him with your uh, request to have a team, so uh, good luck with it, you guys. All right, thanks for having thanks. us this morning. You bet.